Hello, Ninja Squad. Welcome back to the video. Today, we are back in Greenville with another video. In today's video, we are back in Greenville with a brand new series. This brand new series is Greenville News. Yes, you guys heard me correctly. This is a brand new series I am creating for myself and my viewers and also the Greenville community so they can actually figure out on Greenville News. So yeah, this is a brand new series I am bringing to my channel, so if you guys would like to continue to see Greenville news, make sure to go ahead and drop a like, make sure to comment down below saying that you want a part 2, and make sure to also as well subscribe, become an official ND Squad member, but yeah, otherwise, let's go ahead and get right into the news. Alright, so the first news I do have here is we actually have a brand new developer. They used to be a contributor for Greenville, but now they are actually ranked as a developer in the Roblox group. So basically, I went to the Greenville, Wisconsin Roblox group, yes, like, last night, and I noticed that they actually have a brand new developer, which I never knew about, honestly, until I actually went into the Roblox group and figured out that they have actually ranked somebody to developer, which is kind of awkward, because... I already like did my investigation on their Twitter to see what they develop and they actually develop cars which is kind of different I didn't expect them to actually hire somebody that actually develops cars to a developer rank but I don't know but yeah honestly that's really all about the Greenville developer welcome to the team UZ air that is your name on Roblox I'm pretty sure so yeah welcome to the development team I hope you are gonna enjoy your time there but yeah gr new Greenville developers kind of exciting but I'm not sure if they're gonna continue to develop cars or not or maybe they're gonna work on some other features with um within Greenville that's gonna be pretty cool if they actually know behind the scenes about new features they can do for Greenville or not but I'm not sure but yeah, finally, they are now a Greenville developer. I really did not know about them. But yeah, we do have a brand new developer on the development team for Greenville. But yeah, next. Let's get into the next related news of Greenville. The next related news is a badge removal. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and give out credit to Aiden Stenson for this news. Uh, this news is a badge removal. You guys might remember from his video about the Easter Egg Hunt badge. That has actually been removed off the homepage of Greenville, surprisingly. Surprisingly, I'll, like, I don't understand why they removed it, but yes, if I go into the badges page right here, it does not display any Easter Egg Hunt badge. They have completely removed it. But they actually never made an announcement about it. Like, nobody really knows on why it was removed or will it ever be back. Well, but yes, uh, right now I can't really confirm that they're going to add the badge back. But I really like the badge. It actually can show that we have actually collected all of the Easter eggs in the past Greenville update and show what we have actually accomplished in that update. But yeah, that is just my opinion. But yeah. That is really all for that news. Let's go ahead and get into the next news. Alright, so basically the next news is whenever I actually go into the news channel, they have actually posted so many bugs lately. And a lot of people have been considering on why there are so many bugs in Greenville. I'm like, right now, there's not really any bugs as I'm playing. But yeah, like, honestly... There has been a lot of bugs posted in the news channel, just about shutdowns and also some other bugs within the game. So I'm not 100% sure why that is happening, but yes, that is one news I have to go over, is about the shutdowns of Greenville. So yeah, if you guys are wondering why your games are shutting down sometimes in Greenville, well, that's the reason why. They're currently trying to fix game bug, which I'm not 100% sure what the bugs are. But yeah, otherwise, that is really all the news I have for Greenville. I hope you guys did enjoy. Make sure to drop a like, make sure to subscribe button, and make sure to turn your post notifications for all coming videos and live streams. If you guys would like to continue and keep up with the Greenville News news series, I will have a playlist linked in the description or just on top of the screen displaying my brand new playlist for the the Greenville news well yeah but whenever I get some more Greenville news I'll go ahead and make a video so you guys are all informed but yeah make sure to go ahead like subscribe and turn on your post notifications but otherwise your host NZ and I hope to see you guys all in my next Greenville news upload 
Bye, guys.